You have no right to do this. I have every right. I am his king. Well, you aren't mine. Yes, you made that abundantly clear when you lied to my face. You've got a hell of a nerve lecturing me online. Your Majesty, whatever I am guilty of, Suki had nothing to do with it. She was only protecting me. How touching. Silver him. He isn't resisting. You don't have to hurt him. <sighs> Where are you taking him? Suki, stop. You don't have to do this. You've done too much for me already. Yes, you certainly have. That's what this is about? You've been running around sticking your fangs and who knows what else into every girl in town, but the second I move on, you arrest him? Believe it or not, my entire existence does not revolve around what or who is between your legs. Don't you dare speak to me that way! I took an oath to protect the vampires of Louisiana! By handcuffing them in silver? Eric is under the control of necromancers. He is a danger to everyone. You don't know what you're talking about. He's scared and alone. His whole life has been wiped away. He is a liar and a master manipulator. And he would do or say anything to make you his. Well, which is it, Bill? Is he a danger to everyone, or is he just faking it to get into my pants? If you ever loved me, you won't hurt him. This is strictly business. Vampire business. So for once in your life, I strongly suggest you stay out of it. Good night, Siki. I'm not leaving without Eric. If Miss Stackhouse sets foot on my property again, I want her arrested for trespassing. Yes, sir. Are we clear? You can't do this. Bill! Come on, miss. Move along. This is wrong, and you know it! <laughs>